Hello guys, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to talk about early start and early finish and late start and late finish. Let me start with the very first one that is early start. Early start is defined as the at earliest uh, activity can start and whereas early finish is defined as an activity which can be finished without affecting its successor activity. Alright, now let me move to the late start. Late start is defined as how late an activity can start without affecting its successor activity whereas late finish is defined as how late this certain activity can be completed without affecting its duration. We will have a better understanding about these constraints in our practical approach. In this video we are going to talk about early start and early finish and late start and late finish. In order to explain you these constraints, I will be using this example which I have been using for rest of my videos. I guess you guys must be familiar with this. Alright, let's start. Now in order to get early start, I have to go to any of the column headers and I will right click on that column header. After that, I have to select the option that says insert column. I'll click on insert column and it is asking me for the column name which I require. So I say I want the column name for early start. So I'll type early start right and I hit enter. So now I have my early start. So what is an early start? It is how soon it, it, it is a column suggesting how soon the project should be started with defined constraint. All right. Now if I want the early finish column, I will repeat the same procedure. I will right click on the column header and I say insert column and this time I'll take early finish. So I have early finish, I hit enter. Now it gives me the number of dates for early finish. Now what does early finish says? That how soon this project will be completed with the defined task relationship and a defined constraint. Alright, so basically my early finish is nothing but uh, early start plus number of duration. The duration which I have in my duration column. So it is the addition of early start and duration gives me early finish. Alright, so this was about early finish. Now let's move to late start and late finish. We'll try to understand these constraints. So in order to understand, I will get these column in my sheet. So I'll right click on the column header and I'll say insert column. And this time I say late start. Alright, so now I have the late start column. In this column, this column defines that how late that project can be started without affecting the project duration. Alright, and if I want the late finish, I will again repeat the same procedure. I'll say insert column and this time I'll select late finish. Alright then, now I have the late finish. So basically this is defining how late the project can be finished with defined duration. Alright, now if you have noticed, uh, let me show you one thing which is quite interesting. I will, what I'll do in uh, this Gantt chart, I will highlight the critical task. So in order to get the critical task, I have to go to the format tab and I'll click on this checkbox which says critical task. Alright, so now if you see, uh, the critical task, all the critical task will have same for critical task, the early start and the late start will have the same dates because these are critical tasks and it has to be completed on time. But uh, if, if we go to the blue bars, that is this bar and it says master test plan. Now if you see the late start for this is says 22nd of June and the early start is 15th of June. So basically for non-critical task, the early start and late start can vary. But for critical task just like this, for the red bars, the late start and early start is uh, equal. Alright. Now the difference between the late start and late uh, late start and early start is the slack or i can say the float all right we will discuss about slack in my next video so i guess you guys must be aware or you guys understood what does the early start and early finish and late start and late finish means in microsoft project 2013